Welcome back everyone, this is another episode of XCOM 2 Legendary Impossible. I'm Bakira and I will guide you through this mission as well. But at least I will guide you as good as I can, because we are doing Gatecrasher 2.0. We were forced to take 5 rookies to a low profile uh, mission. Uh, thankfully it's one of the old supplies, which, mean, which means we can take as much time as we want. So what we're gonna do is uh, the old uh, step and overwatch. I believe we got at least one extra. That that is correct. I also believe Kali Larsen was present in our previous missions. So uh, this leads me to believe that the randomizer for the names are not that good. Uh, we didn't get an advent guy. That is a tiny bit of a shame. But whatever. First enemies revealed. It's a turret. <sighs> that is so bad. I don't want to fight a turret. Orders confirmed. On the move. Ah, there we go. That's much better. <laughs> That's already an Archon. Uh, something that we absolutely cannot kill at all. So what we're gonna do is prepare for it for the next round. Uh, most importantly, get out of range of the turret. Oh, 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 that's a bad move. That is a terrible move. Okay, now. let's make sure we don't get spotted too easily. Okay, I was careless already, so maybe we'll get punished. Let's hope not, though. We didn't get punished. This is a happy moment for me. However, we still have to move up. And start looking at the at the possibility of triggering that patrol over there. Good copy. Moving on target. Okay, je me dirige vers la cible. Confirmed. We don't see the the Archon anymore. It leads me to believe right. that he moved up. Heading there now. We're gonna try an old school tiny overwatch trap. Let's see if this works. Uh, I call it old school because at the beginning of XCOM 2, so in the beta, so not at the beginning, in the beta of XCOM 2, that at least Spiegel Rush got to play and stream, uh, he discovered that getting spotted by the enemy during their turn in an Overwatch trap made way more sense. Uh, so they had to patch that right in. And the way they patched this, specifically this specific problem, was by adding uh, the possibility that aliens shoot if they reveal you on their turn. So that's why nobody does this tactic anymore. Uh, it's time to, f to hope for the best. This is Rookie 101. Uh, you're just rolling the die. So let's do exactly that. That's a miss. I'll get him next time. No, you won't. Uh, we don't want to go close to the turret again. We really don't care about cover because if they if they shoot, they, they're just gonna hit, uh, no matter what we do. That's a nice, that's a beautiful hit. Nine is really good. Uh, let, let's let this guy teach us a lesson in missing. Uh, I'm hoping that by clamping everyone together... Oh, that's the poison! That is, that is so beautiful. I forgot that we gave everyone a different ammo, so that they could experiment. Uh, I am now extremely tempted to ensure this kill by using this grenade. So I will keep one of the rookies back without shooting. Take this shot for the Spectre. AP rounds, excellent. Who else can move? You can move and you can move. Just two. 59, 53. Let's go with the 59. Let's see if we can get even closer to take that shot. Yeah, this looks good. What we're hoping to accomplish here is that the Archon dies and uh, the Spectre takes someone random over. I think we'd, that would be fine. Uh, the reason we used a grenade, even if it deals for damage, is because it was poisoned. 
Yeah, let's hope it doesn't last too long. Uh, I don't want to bore you all with my careful playing. I'm gonna call it careful playing. We got Shadowbound, just as expected. Uh, we have learned if you kill the Shadowbound unit, you recover your own, so we may have to do this if the Spectre goes to somewhere crazy. Like for example... Uh, that is not entirely crazy. That is just a little bit crazy. Uh, so we could shoot the Spectre from right here, which means someone could drop a grenade on that cover. Let's do that. We need to remember absolutely that uh, some of the grenades will be needed for the Gatekeeper. That is by far the most scary unit of this match. Two units killed. I believe we had 11 to kill. Is that correct, chat? Can anyone remember? If you don't remember, it's all fine. Uh, so what we're gonna do now is let everyone come up. Got it. Boop. Will do. Boop. Start overwatching. I'm on it. Um, there's another thing I want to test, so we will move to get uh, first with this unit. I I want to see if this is like long war where shield wall does not cost an action. It is not, so we keep that in mind. Uh, okay, the mouse, the mouse bug is very very annoying sometimes, uh, where you are pointing at the thing and it just goes to somewhere completely random. Okay, uh, so before we move on with the Overwatch trapping, we are going to do some o uh, some reloading. Because every shot for the rookie counts. Uh, so we're behaving exactly like we would in Gatecrasher. It's just it's a little bit more advanced. Uh, we have a tiny bit of luck that in that we are in the high ground, which means we're gonna be able to take some good shots. However, it is time to take care of the of the turret, because it will somehow, I predict, come back to bite us. Ha! Exactly as predicted. I'm happy we checked uh, that there's too many turrets to, to ignore them. And there's even two units that we have to take care of. So what we're gonna do now is uh, my favorite, break line of sight, run away like a coward. Uh, what we're hoping is that uh, the priest goes holy warrior and the holy warrior goes forward like crazy and if that happens then uh, we'll just go up uh, of course we broke also line of sight from the turrets that was the important thing so if the holy warrior goes up we'll be able to take care of them yes yes the shield wall is a joke compared to to long wars long war one shield walls we did not see any action at all. This worries me a little bit. That's why we're gonna send someone random to scout. That's affirmative. Daisuke Saito. We get nothing. Let's bring everyone to a better position. At least behind cover, upstairs. Out. Uh, we know we have units active. The, the computer does not forget. So we just have to find places for everyone. Like here. And for you, something like, like like a double run. This is the one unit we don't want to expose to possible dangers. Oh, we watch with everyone. Let's see what the computer does for us. We get nothing. So we insist. I'm pretty sure we revealed the units, so I don't know what the computer is doing right now. Wow, this really feels like XCOM 1. I did not miss that at all. Uh, okay, so we are gonna we're gonna scout a little bit more. I'm a bit afraid of this, but 
I don't know. They they seem to have chosen to do something silly instead of coming here. Uh, we're gonna move people around so that more people can have cover. Uh, this is a better cover because of the direction of the enemy units. Move over here behind the tree. And uh, you don't have a spot okay, yet, so just wait around. <laughs> Rookie phobia. <laughs> nice. Take a shot, break the train. Do we get hit? We get mind controlled, of course. Ah, did he miss? Is that a miss? <laughs> Beautiful. Do we get shot? We get shot at. Ooh, they also miss with this. I really don't know what to do. Uh, I wish we were closer. Does this unit have a grenade? They have a grenade. So I could chuck a grenade here, but then all the turrets will be able to, to take fire at us to shoot. And this makes me very unhappy. I could also go with the grenadier and start destroying everything. Rookie of the year. He deserves a prize, and the prize is to not die this turn, I guess. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Uh, we're gonna for forget about the high ground. We're gonna move everyone back. Uh, if, if the priest wants to chase us with a double move, that is perfectly fine by me. Uh, the plan will be to engage from this side. Not only will it block most of the good cover for them, it would force them to come closer, and if they choose not to come, like uh, last turns, then uh, we will engage the turret. Uh, because once that turret is down, uh, I feel much more confident in engaging the enemy. We'll try to see... do you have any ammo? Blue screen rounds, this is perfect. You should be the one to see the turret. Excellent. Now, hit. That is a rookie. That is a rookie. Believe, rookie. Believe. Okay, who else is able to shoot at the turret? You could. What is your ammo? No ammo, because you have the med kit. Oh, this is the guy that survived. Right. Do you have ammo? Venom rounds. Uh, this is plus one damage, which means it will go from 9 to 11. Heading there now. I believe we can take this shot. Uh, no, 8 to 10. Okay, so that would be a kill on 9. <laughs> Never lucky. Okay, uh, Susan, go shoot at the thing. My god, this is all bad. Oh, wow, everyone is hitting. Rookies, rookies. Okay, we take some more cover. And we take good angles and overwatch again. We hope that the unit above doesn't get punished too hard, but she gets punished. This is fine. Uh, we gladly trade uh, a few points of damage that we were obviously gonna take against the chance to destroy this unit. Uh, that's uh, 48, we'll take it. Uh, I'm a bit confused. Was this a uh, high cover for some reason? I don't think so. That's okay, that's okay. All is good. Uh, it's time to take all the shots that we can take. We are not gonna use a grenade for this unit. Or maybe we are, because how does it get so much defense? Okay, good, good, good. That's that <laughs> He says not good, but it's actually really good. So he gets to destroy the cover. And we get to take better shots. That is a beautiful 11, which leaves them at 1 HP. This is not our luckiest day. Uh, let's move over here. Get them to be in a tiny cover. No revenge. That's not, not a good thing. None of these positions would be a good shot. Or would actually be a shot at all. 
And apparently no one else can take a shot at him. From anywhere. That is sad. That is really not good. Okay, so what we're gonna do is move over here. And... Okay, so now the consideration is, do we care more about uh, a hit from this unit, possibly? Or the grenade? How many grenades do we have remaining? One, two, no, one, two... All of these ones, I believe we're free to use a grenade. Yes. Hmm. This is barely enemy number three. Four, if we count the, the turret. I don't even know if turrets count in the count of the shadow chamber. We're exposing everyone because everyone is already exposed. Uh, all we want to do is that the the priest comes upstairs. That would be very useful. He does not, so we grow a pair and we go to visit the... Do you have blue screen? AP rounds. AP rounds is also fine. The priest is in the exact same position as before. He has not moved throughout these all these turns. Uh, but it's time to to go loud. Ah, that's a shame. That would have been a good hit. Is that a blue screen? No. 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 Is that a blue screen? Yes. I see that we could have moved to a better spot. That is a little bit of a shame. Aye, we really needed that to hit. This is now looking very bad. Very, very bad. However, we still have one Trump card, which is the, the Grenadier, so we're gonna use him last. This is Tracer around. We want the blue screen number two. Where is blue screen number two? No one has blue screen number two. I'm surprised. Okay, so we take the normal shots. That's a five. That yes, hey, yes it is. On Keep shooting. Keep missing. I got nothing. Toss me some ammo. Confirmed. Uh, so this cannot be a kill, right? No matter what this guy... What, no matter what this person does... Uh, it cannot kill it. Ah, uh, wait, wait, wait. We still have one more, one more person with actions. That's this person. Okay, so uh, On my way. we are gonna give it a shot. There's two people able to shoot here, and if they don't get the kill, then we will just drop the grenade. That's another Without four. I believe if we can get more. That is not a hit. Ah. And we obviously don't want to take a, a random chance to hit with this one. 68 is just not good. So we're gonna force the hand of the priest. It's a shame, we could have taken 20 million hits of the priest. But this is fun. We had to do the rookie thing. Uh, he gets the mind control. I think this is a hit this time, so we will have to rescue that unit, luckily we are all in position for to do this. So, how does it begin? Does it begin with you running forward like crazy? Roger that. Roger that. We trigger another patrol, this is looking worse and worse. However. Uh, it's still priority to rescue that unit. Oh my god, are we never lucky. Never ever lucky. Also they took our best unit, te technically speaking. Hmm. Doesn't matter. Uh, we do have to spread out now because there's uh, mutants. Mutants have grenades. That is never good. That unit also has grenades, so... We really wanted to rescue the... Oh, okay. We really wanted to rescue the Grenadier. This is quite a shame. 
uh, we can get a little bit closer. Let's see if this is enough to get a, a better grenade. Come on! That is so unfair. So unfair. No grenades remaining. Uh, but uh, we we put someone uh, on the deck below, on the sorry on the level below. That means uh, he will be the one to use his grenade because other everyone else has uh, high ground. So let's spread out and take shots, always from high ground. Try to get this priest. That is a mess. I'm already hating everything. That is a dodge. I guess. Uh, this unit gets to move over here. Uh, I'm pretty sure I played this very wrongly. So um, I'm not. I'm not too sad about the losses that will happen. But uh, I also would have been okay if we had had a little bit more luck or been a little bit more precise. So let's uh, let's find a position where we can still shoot at the priest without putting everyone at risk. This is good enough. Come on, 60%, do it! Okay! We got it. That is a sustain. That allows us to recover our guy. And I believe... Uh, I'm tempted to use a grenade, but it's really not the time. Uh, if we don't, if we cannot pass a test like this, so a moment like this, then it means the gatekeeper would just eat us alive. So what we're gonna do is... Uh, can we just stay where we are? Yeah. So we're gonna stay where we are. Shield wall. Where? Okay. Lesson number two. Shield wall ends the turn. My god. <laughs> yeah, this, this makes me really happy. It's exactly what we needed. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So what else is remaining to do? Let's move over here and take another shot. Good thing we're learning so many things. Let's see what happens now. Maybe this guy goes for Holy Warrior and then we can kill it. That would be very happy. No, we get a stasis. That's bad. We need all the actions. Damn, stasis was not good. Uh, for that reason, however, we're gonna leave the, the priest alive, because Holy Warrior has the best chance to help us. Uh, I don't know in which order will the explosion happen, but it seems like we will be getting hit. And as, as I talked about this a uh, long time ago, uh, the reason why we dropped the Sky Ranger call, emergency call, is because it forces... no. Let me rephrase. It makes units more likely to use Overwatch, which in turn gives me the chance to uh, just shoot at them rather than getting shot from the first moment. So this is a much better trade-off than getting shot at. We already cancelled one Overwatch, so basically we wasted that person's turn. I believe we're gonna get hit by the explosion, so now I can finally learn how much damage it does. I've never known. Those are good hits. That's not a good hit. Hmm. That is a very good hit. I'm very happy about that. And this unit can take a shot at the Codex. Of course we get the hit. I was thinking maybe I shouldn't 
you know, because I don't have anyone else to follow up. And we don't want two clones. But here we are, never learning from our mistakes. Uh, we want to see what happens if we just move over here and reload. I believe Stasis drops first, Stasis, Stasis. Yep, now we get exploded for 7. 7 is, is a damage, so I guess we learn from that. Uh, the priest goes for another mind control because apparently his cooldown is extremely low. I guess at least this unit will not get shot then, maybe. New codex means new psychic bomb or overwatch, I guess that also counts. Suppression? Yes, yes indeed. And then finally someone takes a shot. I guess that's fair. Okay, so how are we gonna solve this? One option would be to grenade these two units. That would solve some of the problems. Uh, we need to remember we cannot move before we take care of these codex somehow. So maybe we just take this shot. Um, what type of cover is she? Th this is this unbelievable. Okay, so this is why I hate uh, bad abilities. Shield wall created cover here, and it never went off. For some reason, it now exists everywhere. I am so confused. I wonder what happens if I move this unit. Will all the shield wall covers drop down? My god, what is happening? Um, okay, so I guess, I guess we can run the overwatch with this unit. Uh, and at the same time check if that's gonna make all the other things disappear. All the shield walls. Run the overwatch, get hit, get hit for three, that is that is fine. Uh, discover that we have created uh, unmovable amounts of cover. Get a head trigger, we absolutely don't want to hit our guy though, so that's fine. Zero percent to shoot back, let's not do that, that seems silly. I believe we should focus on the priest because that guy can kill us. Uh, sorry, the, the we need to liberate our guy. That's what I meant. Or what I wanted to say. We get a hit on the priest. I guess this is fair because we've been uh, suffering a lot under the, the hands of these tyrants. Uh, take a reload. Take a shot. <laughs> Keep getting hits. I guess it's rookie time. <laughs> yes. So someone, someone in chat mentioned that not even the developers uh, use shield wall, and that's why they, sh they never knew about the bugs. I guess that's fair. The ability is really, really bad. Uh, it, which is a shame because Long War had such a good example of how to do shield wall correctly, but I guess they decided to ignore it. Okay. So surprise! Absolutely no one got killed. Uh, not even not even loot was destroyed, so Valen would be proud of us. Uh, I would say this worked out pretty well. However, we still have the final boss remaining, which is the, the gatekeeper. The good thing about it is we kept most of our of our tools. Uh, so we are pretty well equipped to deal with the situation. All we require is that uh, we spot it favorably, which means we will move around this line to the fun, uh, to the bottom, or to the end rather, uh, so that when we trigger the the gatekeeper, he will be absolutely in range with everyone of everyone, and we won't have a problem with that. Overwatch. Overwatch. I don't believe everyone is reloaded, so we're gonna take another round for that. I was partially correct. Most of the people were reloaded. Start moving in diagonal. Moving. Heading there now. Near me. 
We already heard that they they find themselves in such a like a diagonal a direction. Moving on target location. I'm on the move. Understood. Moving out. I'm on the move. Hashtag. Move everyone forward. Overwatch. Like if it was X com one. The best would be if they suddenly come up uh, and then in their turn they decide to go down. Something like this. Or if they just die, that would be the best one. Okay, this unit's a bit behind, so that's why he runs. Alright, uh, uh, another thing we do not want to do is uh, go so much forward that when we approach the train again it will be full of turrets. I don't know if there will be more, but you know, there's no reason to to test our luck. We're getting a little bit closer to the side, so that uh, anyone will be able to run in one turn towards the ledge and get the shots off. And now it's time for the reveal. We'll do the reveal with... Oh, 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 oh. Is that a, a free shot? On a nothing? Yes, it is. Will someone come upstairs to get shot? That would be nice. Oh, hello. Miss. 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 One hit. And it was the AP round. Two hits. That is amazing. Ladies and gentlemen, we got two hits. That is just insane. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Uh, we're very happy about what happened. They came to us and we even got to do some damage to the gatekeeper, who was the most important unit. And these guys have stood behind. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna move to the side uh, with everyone while still taking all the shots that we can so that uh, these units are too far away to uh, to see us from below, right? So there's no line of sight here. So we need to go behind this line, so to speak. And they're also be too far to just run up and shoot. However, the first movement that we're gonna do, perform, is... Where is it? It's this one. So we want to check first what's the range on the acid grenade. That is just beautiful. I'm inclined to shoot from here, but we should not. We had a plan, so we should stick to it. We don't want to go too far away. Uh, so I guess here is perfectly fine. Acid grenade deals more shredding than normal uh, plasma grenade. I believe it will be five, if I'm correct. Additionally, it puts acid on people. Five shredding, that is just insane. Do we have another grenade? Yes, we do. That is fantastic. So this unit uh, also wants to stay somewhat relatively safe, like here. And also use the grenade on the gatekeeper. The reason for this is because uh, two armor is really a lot when we have to hit like five more times, I believe, in order to get the kill. So. Let's start spreading units, well, going over here. Uh, we absolutely do not want to stay together if there is a gatekeeper existing. Because the gatekeeper can psi rift everything and it just makes everything horrible. Uh, I do believe if we don't kill the gatekeeper we will just lose the mission. So uh, I'm willing to sacrifice anyone and everyone to do it. My god, this shot will be amazing if we hit... Oh, oh, that is beautiful. That is so beautiful. I'm, I'm even inclined to put sacrificial people over here to get uh, a big better chance to hit. How about this? 50-50. How about this? 40. How about this? 38. Okay, so we'll take one last cover. I guess this is still spread enough. Miss. 
<laughs> Even one grenade would get the kill. Um, you know what? Ben Green, we believe in you. Come over here. Get it done. Get it done. No. Yes. Okay. So, um, even if this unit has acid, the chances that it deals for damage, I think, are zero. Yep. One, two, three. Ah. Uh, I guess. I guess we could come here and and hope for the best. That, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm already so sad. Cause. I, I believe we have stretched our luck to the maximum. Oh my god! We killed the gatekeeper. I don't care about anything. This is working. Something exploded over there for no reason at all. It's still fine. Was that a double move? That was not a double move, so we get a free shot for them. At seven. Uh, that is... Uh, another seven, but one gets a shred. And what about you? You get suppressed. That is all fine, my friend. Let's call a new Sky Ranger. Yep, all is good. So what will we do? Um, we we want to take first the the high ground shots. So let's move over here. We have a flank. Actually, let's take the flank. <laughs> Why do I even try? Uh, we want to use all our grenades. Uh, so we no longer care about uh, keeping stock. That means this uh, this guy is relieved of his suppression. Oop. Also of his cover. Uh, it's time to me... It's time for me to take revenge. That means... Wait. This unit has all his health. Uh, we move over here. And we flank the guy that is right here. This has to be a kill. Yes! Enemy is down. Move over here. Get the shoot from above. That may be a flank. Of course it's one damage before the kill. Of course. Let's see who else can take a shot before moving. No one. So, wait. Who do you see from here? No one? Okay. We move here. Oh no. <laughs> that got scary. We see that there is still one more pot. I guess we should have counted better. But it's all fine. Uh, we are in a good position right now. Because the gatekeeper is dead. And we'll see what how we deal with the rest. We get a random shot in. Uh, maybe we even get a kill. Maybe, maybe, maybe not. Maybe yes. Confirmed. Maybe we get a kill. This will be a fun thing, right? 50-50. <laughs> uh, okay, so this is how a bunch of rookies can clear a pod of four uh, in the turn that they're that they're surviving. Um. I believe the acid is gone, which lets me take position right here. So what we're gonna do is uh, reload. And overwatch trap, one turn. Uh, if they move to us, that's a bunch of free hits. If they don't, uh, we start gathering our people. Because they're a little bit dis dispersed right now. Dispersed. Mm, this is the scout equivalent. Overwatch again. Let's see how close we can move uh, while staying in high ground and maybe trigger them. Yep, so we did that. Is that only two advent? One, two. That is incredible. Okay, this actually looks really good. Um, however, we want to start with people that have special ammo. 
Venom blue screen. Perfect. So let's do it. By the way, no one... Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Blue screen. Nope. Blue screen. AP rounds. Okay, these are good enough. We want to spread out a little just in case we don't kill the mech. But that looks good. This already looks too level. I believe we made a mistake in our initial estimation and nobody else had uh, blue screen rounds. Tracer. Nothing. Nothing. And we already did a round. So we'll just take shots. I don't care about anything anymore. Yep. It is. Uh, this is a Venom round, so we're gonna take a shoot shot over there. <laughs> so much fun. No poison though. Fine. Get the kill on the mech. This was important. No, never use medikits. Fine. That's a nice idea. Move over here. Pretend that we will get the kill. Actually get the kill. Mission is over. Easy peasy. Alright people, we got it done. It's uh, 6 rookies, 6 wounds. I guess that's fair. <laughs> it's beautiful. Uh, I'm really surprised that nobody died. I was kind of counting on that. <laughs> yes, the trick shot was an important part of the finish. Uh, we get a free seat, we don't know why. That's fine, it's all good. Everyone gets a promotion! Ah, uh, ah, uh, the beginning of the game is fun. So, who are our soldiers? Uh, Ranger! Uh, sniper! This guy gets Shredder! Oh, congratulations, you did it! Eight protocol, a support, a grenadier, because we need more, and another support. Okay, this was pretty. Uh, we even got paid off for it. I think we destroyed zero boxes, so that's really amazing. Uh, we got a plus three mobility PCS. That is that is okay. Uh, most importantly, a billion crystals and more supplies. We're happy. Okay, so. We move on. I believe uh, we had a plan and we need to say when do we get to do it. Uh, what was the plan by the way? Ah yes, yes, yes. We had uh, the you intel thing. A vessel of the elders wisdom. And with it goes your opportunity at understanding the knowledge it contains. Oh what a shame, Warlock. Understanding, very important for strategy. Um so the, the covert operation will finish in two days. I don't believe we will be ready in two days. Against the elders, we find but but uh, discovering every Chosen is very important. Okay. Let's find out what will we start doing next. So now that, now that we are uh, done with the Chosen missions, we can now start looking at exactly what we need. It could even be a soldier reward, so we'll pay attention to those as well. Like we could get a superior weapon upgrade. This is this is nice when you need to round up your team. Uh, ability points is even good. And that's a mobility bonus. I like those. Aim, intel. I guess we could do the intel thing. Uh, PCS also nice. Will plus three not nice. Will plus four not nice. Recover loot. Reduce avatar project. Wow, none of these are stellar. The month is about to end too, right? I believe so. Or maybe we just ended the month. I don't remember. I believe we just ended the month. Okay, so uh, getting abil ab ability points looks good. So we're gonna see who is gonna be the lucky person. Aki is. Oh my god, holo targeting. This is so pretty. Uh, Alright, so I have made my. Mm. Yes, so we're gonna we're gonna give the points to Aki. Is she tired? No, this is not what we wanted to click. 
any more days. Uh, we want to consider going to do the the mission right now. And in order to consider that, we should just go there. Chosen stronghold. Fourteen enemies. Let's see, who is available for this? Let's remove everyone-ish. Um, do we have our specialist grenadier pair? Yes, we do. This is a pretty good start. This is the good weapon, so it's already still there. Let's make everything available to the units that will also join us. Uh, beam. War. Threadstorm. Frosty. Um, Skulljack. Medkit times a million. Uh, I am not going this is the good reaper. We really wish this reaper and uh, uh, Aki got a little bit better along because that's a bond we would like to see. And the last bond is the skirmisher and Gika because that just is the stellar team of course. These two go together right? Yes. This is a good team. There's no reason to break it. Let's do it. Axe. Mimic beacon. That's not grenade. Nothing, nothing. Serpent. War. Bullpup. That was a good one. This is the good one. Blue screen rounds. Let's not repeat what happened last time. Uh, blue screen rounds again. Dragon ammo. Dark lance, dark claw, serpent armor. Duck, duck, duck. Check, 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 check. Okay, everything looks good. I believe we are ready. You know what is really bad? Uh, it's it's pretty late, and I have had the most viewers as always uh, ever. Sorry, I'm having the most viewers ever. However, it is really late. I have to make dinner and take care of the cat, uh, so I will have to cut the stream here. There's a chance I'll come back later, uh, but I'm sorry guys, uh, this is where I cut for now. Thank you very much for joining and I will see you soon.